Hey there guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks so much for watching today. Today is a really awesome day because we're actually going to see Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem, the brand new movie. And we're not gonna see the movie in any old way. We're actually gonna be going to a early screening that is a Q&A with the director. I am super excited about it because I've been pumped for this movie. We were able to go to the Enter the Lair experience last week and now we're getting to see the movie. So I'm definitely pumped. I'll show you a little bit about the experience when we get there as much as I can. But before we do that, I do wanna make sure to run over to Target because I have seen that Target does have some of the new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Pops, including the exclusive Leo and Pizza Van. And I thought it'd be fun to try to pick that up the day that we're actually going to the screening. So let's not waste any more time, guys. Let's get into Target and let's get hunting. And we are here at Target. And as soon as you walk in, it looks like they do have a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem set up here. And it looks like there's some different plushes of Donatello and Michelangelo looks like Rocksteady and Beep Bop there too, and some different things for kids. And then back in the Funko section, it looks like they have a lot of actually some pretty good stuff. They have some new Indiana Jones pops, Yellowstone, The Witcher, Avatar Dungeons and Dragons, Moon Knight. Down here, they have one of the new SDCC exclusives, Captain Marvel, pretty cool. They do have some of the build a set from Spider-Man No Way Home, like Doc Ock and Sandman, along with Luke and Chewbacca on Java Skiff. And then I walk down to the toy section and they do have another Mutant Mayhem area here with a bunch of different toys. Got some pretty cool figures here. On the side, even more TMNT figures. You even got the pizza van there. And down here, they do have the 10 inch Leonardo and Leo in the pizza van too. This is what we were looking for. Such a cool pop. We secured the pizza van, the TMNT loot. Definitely very happy about that. It's completed at Target. So now let's head over to Century City and see this movie. All right, guys, and we are back home from seeing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem. It was an absolute blast going to see the film. We got to see it early thanks to Collider. They did an early screening. We were able to RSVP online. They usually do a little giveaway. You can sign up. But the first few people who sign up automatically get RSVP'd for the event. So we got super lucky with that where I got right on top of it right away. And I was really excited to be able to go to a Q&A, our first one since we moved out here. But unfortunately, there was some problems with the Collider Q&A and they were not able to have the director come in. So unfortunately, we were not able to go to the Q&A. So we drove all the way to Century City for nothing. But it's okay because it was still a brilliant film. If you are a Ninja Turtles fan, you're going to love this one. Even if you're not a huge Ninja Turtles fan, you're still going to really enjoy this because it is absolutely hilarious. So much fun. Great characters, great animation, an amazing story, and even some pretty good emotion in there as well. I absolutely recommend going to see Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem. It does hit theaters this Wednesday across the country, so definitely make sure you go ahead and check it out. And this was definitely one of my more anticipated films of the year especially since i've started to see the trailers over the past number of months this thing looks so much fun it absolutely lives up to the bill and you can say for sure that this is the best teenage mutant ninja turtles movie ever made which isn't a super high bar but still it is true so we had a really awesome tmnt style day because not only did we see the movie we did go on that little funko pop hunt over at target and we were able to pick up one of those pops. Now I was hoping to actually see more TMNT pops there. I was hoping to maybe see some of the commons because there are the four turtles, but there's also Superfly, there is Splinter, April O'Neil. So there are some really cool characters, especially after seeing the movie, I wanted to get more of those characters. But I would still pass on the turtles because I am waiting for the Amazon exclusive four pack to come in the mail. I should be getting it sometime over the next week. So as soon as I have that in hand, I'll absolutely be showing it off. But luckily they did have the two Target exclusives there, which were really awesome to see. And I actually have one of them right here in my hands. And that one is the Leonardo in Pizza Van. This is a Target exclusive pop ride. 
super cool figure right here. I really love it, and I did love seeing it this moment in the movie where they have the pizza van show up, and you have Leonardo driving it here. This is such a super cool figure. And I just love the turtles designs in general in this movie, especially with the pop. So having Leonardo jumping out the top of the van is really pretty cool. And the van itself is super detailed. I love how it has pizza on the side, even has the pizza slice on the top of it. And then on the front, you see it says turtle power. And then you have like a pizza pie on the other door with a slice being taken out and all in that yellow and green. I think this is a really cool pop ride. And if you did want to see the rest of the figures in the wave, they are right there on the back. We have the four turtles, Splinter, and April O'Neil along with Superfly. And then there was a 10 inch version of, I believe Leonardo, we did see it there at the Target store, was pretty cool, but I do not want to collect more 10 inch figures, especially if it is for a character that has a regular four inch pop. I'd rather go with that or get some pretty interesting ones like the pop ride. So there we have it guys, there's our look at our quick Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Mutant Mayhem Funko Pop hunt over at Target along with us actually going to see the movie. I'm sorry I couldn't show more of the film. Of course, I'm not going to be actually filmed in the theater while the movie's going on and I wish I actually was able to see the Q&A because I would have actually gotten some clips of that to share with you guys of director Jeff Rowe, but maybe in the future we can do another sort of event like that and be able to show more to you guys about those sort of screenings because they are super cool. And I was really pumped to see this one, but unfortunately things did happen. We were not able to see the Q and A, but I still really enjoyed my time at the movies. But now I do want to throw it over to you guys. What do you think about our TMNT Funko Pop hunt? and the Leonardo in Pizza Van Pop Ride. Have you been able to pick that up for your collection? Did you get any of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem Funko Pops for your collection? And would you like to see me try to pick up more of the figures from this set? Like I said, we do have the Glow in the Dark 4 pack from Amazon coming soon of the Turtles. Superfly is definitely a character that I would love to get as a pop, especially seeing how cool he was in the movie as the villain, seeing him as a pop. I definitely do want to grab that one. And Splinter was another really fun one too. And maybe they can make more TMNT pops in the future inspired by this film. I would love to possibly pick those ones up as well. But let me know what your guys' thoughts are on all this in the comments down below. And of course, if you guys have not done so already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also leave a like on this video as well if you enjoyed it. And of course, you can always hit that notification bell to be notified whenever we have new videos drop. But thank you guys so much for watching today. And as always, we'll see you again real soon.